What is going on guys, Mobile Carrier News here and Verizon is ready to introduce network slicing. Well, what they're basically doing is they're preparing it. Um, what network slicing is, is basically they're making the network more smooth, they can run more efficiently, applications run faster, um, your speeds improve, not only your speeds, but also your, um, whenever you're loading up a web page or anything on YouTube, it just works on faster. Whether you're on YouTube, if you have, um, what's that thing called? Even if you have uh, YouTube Premium, anything that avoids an ad, everything will just move uh, on along smoothly. Whatever application you're using, and this is really good. I like I like that it's starting. It's the start of twenty twenty three, and Verizon is preparing for network slicing. Now it's not. Now they're not saying in this article when they're going to um, basically release it to the public, but they have been testing it for about a year or two now, and they're seeing good performance. They're seeing good performance on their five. I'm not sure if it's about their five G home internet. But they're seeing improvements in their gaming, in their business, and even and even uh, even us as mobile consumers, uh, as you can see, I am on Verizon. I'm using their five G network, and even on mobile, they're improving it to make sure it runs smoothly and effectively as possible. And I really like where Verizon is going with this. I like that they are, are testing the network, doing network slicing as a whole, making sure the network is is reliable, improving, make sure there's no issues because the last thing Verizon wants is customers having issues when they release this network slicing to the public and everyone else. And it wouldn't make sense if Verizon is the number one most reliable network with the most coverage, it doesn't make sense for their 5G network plus the slicing, their network slicing to just not perform as well. And I like where Verizon is going with this. They really are improving this now. Like I said, it's not. It's not going. They're not saying when this is coming. Uh, I'm guessing they're going to announce this when a time comes. I'm going to guess maybe March or April. Um, they have been testing this for about a year or two now. Um, they're still testing in the process. I like that they're doing that. They're testing it, like I said, for gaming, for their network, for mobile, for usability, reliability, their business, all that stuff. But I'm guessing this year it has to come out because they have been testing it for quite a long time. And I'm really excited for this. Um, I will leave a link to this article in the description so you guys can read it off. This is something very interesting that I'd like to see Verizon doing. Um, I'm not sure if the other two carriers are doing this yet. Maybe they are. I know every the carrier is doing their own kind of networking with their 5G network and their core. But I really like where Verizon is going with this because they're actually going to they're actually going to release this and you're going to see better improvements and overall better usability and i'm just i'm just hyped for this i'm i'm curious to see where verizon is going to go with this but let me know what you guys think about this do you guys think this will come out sooner than expected because this is this is coming out for everything like i just said everything the 5g the mobile the gaming uh, the whole experience is going to come out to everyone and it's going to be interesting let me know what you guys think about this hope you guys enjoy this video subscribe for more videos, videos like this and i'll see you in the next one peace